Israelites come out to prophesy the downfall of this kingdom, to rise up the elect, to the spirit of the Most High, whoever they may be, and to condemn the two thirds of our people who don't want to accept this word and the other nations. Let them know they're going into slavery. Let them know that the Lord's time is nigh. All right, and that just live it up until that time because it's coming. It's soon. All right, go ahead, start this thing. Yeah. Psalms chapter 89, verse 21. I'm going to start up at uh, 19. Right. Surely thou will slay the wicked, O Most High. That's right. Depart from me, therefore, ye bloody men. Bloody boy. First of all, why are they bloody men? First of all, look at the so called white man's history. His history is full of blood. His track record says blood. His track record has blood all on it. It's full of sins of his youth. Right, man. You ever seen it? Boy, you ever seen a movie where it's a real, it's a real graphic scene, and it's blood everywhere, and everybody just screaming? Yep. That's the white man's track record. Yeah. Karen got precepts. A goddamn bloody, scary movie, man. This motherfucker does nothing but kill, steal, and destroy. Those, well, if I can say this, those are his so-called greatest motion pictures. Those are his, his staple movies. If it's not gory, then it's not really, you know, good, a good action movie. It doesn't really capture right. your attention. Right. Yeah. Okay, go ahead. Karen. This is Obadiah, verse 6. How are the things of Esau searched out? How are his hid things sought up? All the men of thy confederacy have brought thee even to the border. The right. men that were at peace with thee have deceived thee. Right, so everything this white man is doing, all this bloodshed which was which was prescribed by the Most High at the end of the day, for prophecy's sake, and that's one thing you gotta know, because you still got newcomers coming to you, they don't understand it. Right. For right. prophecy's sake, because the Most High set up that way, but it doesn't matter, the white man's still a devil, and he still has to carry out him being a devil. Right. So he's still guilty. That's right. All right, and guess what? Everything he's done, man, guess what? Everybody around the world is just waiting to get a hold of this white man. All these other nations is waiting to get a hold of this white man. Matter of fact, it's a movie of, uh, I had one in a red box called, uh, called the Captain Phillips. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fake now, 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 at first, I was like, at first, watching the movie, you know, you gotta get into a movie, so you gotta wait a little bit. But, man, I was like, I was disappointed that they didn't get them, get that white man. Get, uh, what, what Tom Hanks and his crew. I was actually disappointed. I was like, nah, oh, man, don't have him hook up the cord on the, on the, th well, I want to tell the movie, let me be quiet. Right. <laughs> Spoiler alert. Yeah. I don't want to spoil your movie. But basically, I wanted them to, 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 to do, you know, to actually, Thrive, but and they didn't. That's basically what you know. Well, go ahead. That whole Captain Phillips movie. If you do the research and find a real Captain Phillips, yeah. that movie's a damn lie. Yeah. Half of the stuff, seventy percent of the stuff that happened in that movie is fake, man. Yeah. So Esau be overfabricating heroism and patriotism when that stuff didn't even happen. Well, hey, hey. Matter of fact, like the brother saying, any movies that the white man has that's just based on a true story, best believe he's gonna add some shit to it. To make it better. I got it. Because he gets the original story, he says, you know what, that ain't good enough. Right. You know, let's let's make it where you fall fall uh, fall this way or you know, he just add something to to to, to bring dramatics to it. Right, right. All right? right. No, but that's the same no nah, but hey bro, that's the same thing with that movie Lone Survivor. Man, oh, with yeah, that, that yeah. with Mark Wahlberg and the man, that is such bullshit. Yep. You can't tell me, uh, even out, even after he survived, they show you scenes where motherfuckers is going down fighting. Motherfucker done got shot in the back of the head, then it jumped off of cliffs and all broke every goddamn bone, and these motherfuckers are still up fighting. Who the fuck was around to say they did all that? That's the mighty white man, though. Huh? <laughs> like, you, saw, you saw that You saw that first uh, image when they started the movie, how the Marines, yeah. you know, we, we just, we go through this, and we go through that, but we hang in there. We, we stand tall. And then the main motherfuckers that been lost, they got hey, their hey, money, man. Hey, 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 goes back to the white man is a liar. The white man is a liar in many ways. Right. In many ways. Go ahead. The men that were at peace with thee have deceived thee and prevailed against thee. They that eat thy bread have laid a wound under thee. Right, because what? In prophecy, which is coming up, which hasn't been totally fulfilled yet, man. Well, those other nations, man, actually, when the, when the Lord put the spirit on them other nations to go ahead and push that button and actually get real aggressive, 
towards America, everybody in America is gonna be scared of their fucking mind. They will because because America's so comfortably walking around thinking that everything that America has done ain't gonna come back to them. They're comfortable. So when that aggression goes on a record high, beyond what they have seen, they're gonna be freaking scared of their goddamn mind, man. Let's say something. And the nations know that um they never forgot that in particular nations that you done business with, they have forgot like the the the, the you 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 uh the, the, that's a good word, but uh you being under being deceitful with them. Like for example, sorry. When uh, the, the whole thing was going on like in, Af in the Middle East with Russia, all right, in Afghanistan, the America used to call the, Ma the Afghanis and Iraqis freedom fighters. They was down with them at one point. They were selling them arms and everything to help fight off Russia. That's kind of what that movie, uh, one of the Rambos is about. Yeah. I, I can't remember which one. But then, years later, you turn around and call the same people terrorists. Now they're the new face of terrorism. So people ain't forgot about this shit. They, the, and, 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 and all your allies know your little dirty underhanded tricks that you try to pull on the whole world. So at some point they're gonna get pissed off and then they're gonna turn and shoot missiles on this bitch. It's like that movie uh, Lord of War with uh, Nicolas Cage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Right, right, so look, the brother, the, 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 the point we make it is that, man, if you just stay watching and, 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 and prepare yourself, man, the Lord is gonna bring that spirit on them, man. Is it on that? No, I got more. God. There is none understanding in him. Shall I not in that day, saith the Lord, even destroy the wise men out of Edom? Right, the wise men, yo, yo, so called woman, these witches, these, these, the top warlocks of Edom, all right, that, that practicing deceiving you, all right, that practicing setting your ass up. All right, and try to and try to put the destruction on your ass on our whole net on the whole world on every element. What is the what is the plants? What is the trees? What is the animals? Every everything of life he tries to destroy and twist. It. No, he does. Bro. Right, he does, right. He, does. he right. does twist it. I mean, like you right. got. We were just talking about the confusion going on right now where where they got uh, this is right, man. This man is trying to let, put his wife to rest. Well, really, she's dead. She done went brain dead. And they trying to they trying to keep the baby alive, but the baby is getting all deformed and shit. Because that woman's spirit is no longer in her body. Oh, wait, 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 wait. But then, like we was talking, we was actually talking about this earlier before we started up camp. And I told I said, look, how is it that you don't want this family, all right, to pull the plug? On that family member that's pregnant, right? Because of the, oh, the baby. No, you know, keep the baby alive. But then Keisha can go to a freaking abortion clinic. That's right. That's right. Right? Yeah. Right, right. Yeah. Fucking crazy, man. That's she, right. She can go to a clinic and kill the baby that's, that's alive right, in her right now. And you know what, brother? That's the number one killer right there. It's a so called black woman, man. That's right. That's right. Now, here, now I, I went to, before, you know, before Ken, I went to go get something to eat. And uh, this black bitch in there talking about. Get, getting drunk and the damn food ruining everybody's supper. Talking about, I love the white man. I love him. Now this is an upscale area, man. If, I'm gonna get it right back to you. Somebody give me Isaiah three because that's the number one. That's the number one way that you get the people in captivity, man. How do you do that? By the woman. You talking about three and twelve? Three and woe, a woe to a woman that is easy. Oh yeah. Uh, oh okay. okay. You can start at twelve too. That's, that's fine, I'm whatever you want, brother. 32 and 9. 32 and 9. Because you black women, man. I'm saying black women for a reason, man. Right. You Southern tribe, man. Y'all the worst people I've met in my entire life, man. How, how are you going to be satisfied with being in America, man? You should be tired of this place, man. Go ahead, brother. Con, this is Isaiah chapter 3, verse 12. As for my people, children are their oppressors, yeah. and women rule over them. Children are their oppressors, rule, and women rule over them, man. If you go to every single uh, 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 middle management jobs, at least that nature, who has them? That are our color. Black women, man. And they look at you like shit. And they treat you like shit. They deem you as shit, man. And you got these stupid ass niggas talking about the black woman is God, man. A person, a person that'll kill her own child. That's not God, man. That's the 
devil. That's right. But you know what they're getting in from the so-called white man, man. That's right. That's right. That's right. The white man will last lives in every single aspect to kill. That's right. They say hey, that's a, it's just a fetus. It's just a fetus. Nah, hell. It's not. It's not a. It's not a baby. Not kill. Say, so they kill it. Murder. Yeah. Murder. Yeah, yeah. murder. Yeah, right. Kind. That's right. Hey, 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 hey. Let me say this. That's right. You know what you're saying, brother, about the black woman. But let's concentrate on all them goddamn women of our tribes. That's right. Because because they more and more acting like the, the, the southern tribe. Yeah. The, the, the Puerto Rican. Yeah. All right. You know what I'm saying? All the Latino tribes are acting more and more as the nigga time woman. goes by like the nigga woman. The nigga right. woman is chief. You know what I'm saying? Because yep. you got to tell somebody, like somebody said, well, you know what? Those Latin women, a uh, uh, Latin tribe, are more submissive. The more, but guess what? But guess what? That's starting to wear off. That's right. Because why? They getting that independent club type That's right. shit. That's right. In their system. That's you know right. what I'm saying? They going to the abortion clinic just like Keisha. You know what I'm saying? Especially them. Because they got all they got there. They get pregnant every goddamn week. That's right. Man. So you know, they go in the abortion clinic. You know what I'm saying? With that, with that, uh, with that Keisha like attitude. Because the thing is that the whole 12 tribes, all our women, oh. uh, of all church, when I say black, I'm talking about all their asses. That's right. Because they come from one. That's right. They come yeah. from one seat. That's right. Right, brother? That's right. They come from That's one seat, right. so. But that, that nigga woman's off the chain, though, man. Right. Girl. With the hair that one, bitch right. off the chain, man. Exactly. She didn't want that. Woe to you niggas, man. That's right. right. Woe to you niggas that call her God. A queen. That's right. Shit. That's right. If you want change in your community, man, you, you have to look at your people or you have to judge them, man. That's right. That's where change comes from, man. That's right. Somebody give me 1 right. Corinthians 62. That's right. That's where change comes from, man. Judgment is to look at something and evaluate it and form an idea or opinion of it. Well, uh, behind much evaluation, man. This is how you going to change. And that's how you going to judge that's, it, that's, man. Because there ain't no change in a nigga, that's man. That's how you going to change it. Now the scripture say, it's like I forget what it says at. It says, uh, it says, uh, shoot, I, I, uh, Lucy Paraphrase is basically saying, man, I mess you, the most I say, I mess you up. I mean, how much more can I mess you up, man? Yeah, yeah. You know? Go ahead and get that right quick. Yeah. First you got it, bro. I ain't even gonna try to do it. Go ahead. First Corinthians 62. 62, it's a lot. This is First Corinthians chapter 6, verse 2. Do ye not know that the saints shall judge the world? That's right, man. The saints are going to that's most are willing. That's the one that's us. That's the one third. Most are willing. We're part of the elect. That's right. What is right. it saying? Go ahead. And if the world shall be judged by you, are ye unworthy to judge the smallest matters? So you can't see the black woman is not God, man? You can't be realistic about your state? And be honest? And go ahead and say, man, our people are messed up, man. That's right. That's right. Our people are in all types of madness. That's right, man. But you know what? That goes back to you people. You niggas, man. You motherfucking niggas, man. Trusting the black and the white man, man. That's right, brother. Trusting the white man, man. They ought to be trusting in that black woman, man. That's right. Because she's your... She's your... Hey, man, the, the, the black woman, man, is your enemy, man. That's right, brother. She has a... Oh, she has, she, has, she has a fucking cycle every goddamn month, but that's a guy. Right? That bitch is, man, right? come on, man. Come on, man. You niggas are stupid, man. J just as simple as shit, man. You niggas are simple, man. You should be ashamed of yourself, man. You should be ashamed of yourself, man. <laughs> Pussy, they want to Go ahead, down. give me, uh, uh, you got something? Kind, Go just ahead, do it. Proverbs chapter 1, verse 22. How you, how long, ye simple ones, yeah. will ye love simplicity? How long you gonna love being in the hood, man? How long you gonna love your people, man, your, your goddamn women, man, being hoes and sluts, man? And you rationalize a car and say they're gods, say they're twerking is revolutionary, man. That's not revolutionary, that's a shame, man. Man, you should be ashamed of ourselves, man. It, man, the both sides gonna come back, man. He's gonna destroy you people, man. And righteously so, man. And if you a person that's believing that Egyptology and you got and you listen to this, man, you need to come up out the day before you get yourself killed, man. That's right. Cause that ain't nothing but wickedness, man. That's right. It ain't nothing but folly. That's a whole bunch of nigga with itching ears, man. Running or uh, going to and fro to what, what Dasha says suits them, man. You know why niggas do that? I'll tell you why niggas do that. Because you can rationalize your wrongs by doing that, man. Yep, no right. filter. You can be with any type of nigga that you want to be in, 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 in that kind of mind state. Right. Go ahead and finish.
good is that, bro? Come on. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And the scorners yeah. delight in their scorning That's right, and man. fools hate knowledge. Fools hate knowledge, man. A nigga hate to get uh, corrected, man. Yep. That's our people, man. And then, and, and, and nigga, nigga know how to philosophy. You got it. A nigga know how to philosophize and basically rationalize their wrong, man. For some more bullshit. I saw a nigga to make uh, a, a nigga can make uh, uh, twerking sound so eloquent, King Noble. Yeah. Nigga, you a hoe. That's right. Yeah. Well, how, how, how could you condone that, man? I got a little sister, man. Yeah. I got a mother, man. I got cousins that I care for. Yeah, I mean, two, yeah, they're two thirds, but guess what I care for? I went there, uh, uh condone them, turkey, nigga. What type of bitch ass nigga is you, hey, man? Hey, hey, uh, hey, hey, hey. But then, like, oh, wait. but then, right, you got my size, right? Which that's all, that's, that's been the top. Check it out. On, on her, on her video when she's twerking, right? Yeah. Who does she get to 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 Niggas. help it up by her while she's twerking? Niggas. A whole bunch of nasty yeah, ass yeah, black so bitches. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? That that's big like freaking whales shaking their ass on the ground, shaking their ass. Cause she know they, she knows that yeah. black women are hoes. She knows, she know, they know they, they, they know how to do it. Exactly, man. When we get into something, man, we go all out, man, including yeah. our women, man. Yeah. yeah. That's right. Straight wicked, man. And you got you got this uh you got this one bitch, she a video vixen. She was like slept around with Chris Brown, now she messing with Orlando Scandrick. She was on a national radio show and they was like, Do you feel like you a hoe still? And she's like, I don't feel like I'm a hoe no more. Your wholeness can get deleted. What the fuck is that? You know what I'm saying? Ain't no you ain't got no you ain't got no uh, delete history on your pussy, man. No it's, it's done. A <laughs> pussy got mileage just like a car. Once it's on there, it ain't going away, man. So she loops it up. Hey, can I add to this? Add to that I'll show you the hypocrisy in the clowns. They'll say the twerk is revolutionary and they'll condone it, but then the same group of people will be upset when the men when the elders say that in the Bible rape or taking a woman by force yeah. is permissible. Right. Yeah. So if you see a girl twerking and you want to go and snatch her up and let it be one of their little cousins and sisters, they don't have a problem with that shit. Mm -hmm. Wait a minute, nigga, I thought you said it's revolutionary. Yeah. But you, but you know what, you watching that, you watching them twerking, man, you know you're going to feel some type of way, man. You mostly know if you a man. So you basically just gawking at another man's woman, man. Basically. Or somebody, such so, 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 so black queens, you gawking at, if you want to get on the elementary level, you you looking at somebody's daughter, man. So you you better than what the Bible say? That's yeah. God. Come on, that's man. God. You're, man, you're a hypocrite, man. These niggas, man, these niggas are stupid, man. That's why two-thirds of our people going to be destroyed, man. And righteously so, man. Our Thanks, people huh? ain't shit, man. Yeah, Did you got something? Go ahead, bro. Jeremiah chapter 2, verse 11. You got it, bro. Hath the nation changed their gods, which are yet no gods? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Have a nation changed their gods? This, this niggas is changing they changing. Yeah. Who's supposed to be the most high, right? Yeah. The, the one who created the universe, you know what I'm saying? Through the sun, the moon, no, no. all elements. That's right. Right? Huh? To a woman. Yeah, like, to a woman. Matter of fact, I was telling brother, I said, man, I don't think that nigga believe that. But then I said, you know what? But I said, you know what? Niggas strong delusions. Yeah. Strong delusions is what they are. Yeah. A strong delusion is that for you to say that a woman is God would equal to a strong delusion. That's great folly. So I'm pretty sure he does believe that. But at the same time, that nigga just want attention, man. Yeah. yeah. And, and that's, yeah. All, that's all it is. He wants some attention and 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 he knows that saying that ridiculous, saying that a woman is God, saying that ridiculousness, he knows that that's going to have people have, view, have them get views, you know what I'm saying? He, he already ain't got no faith in, in the word, you know what I'm saying? How you going to argue with a nigga who don't believe in the most high? You know what I'm saying? How you going to argue with a nigga who don't believe in the scriptures? Yeah. That, that argument can only go so long, man, so far, until it's like, look, nigga, I'm uh, nigga. I'm done talking to you, nigga. Yeah, brother, That's, right. That's right, man. Go ahead. But my people have changed their glory for that which does not profit. That don't profit. Like the brother say twerking. Hey, 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 twerking is revolutionary. Hey, 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 hey. He eating pork. Hey, all kinds of shit that, that black people are known to do in this world, man. It's not profiting them. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Oh, wait. Open up soup kitchens. They don't profit you, man. Wow. I ain't gonna prop you, man. The Lord said you're supposed to eat this bread, the word. Eat that. That's right. Why? Because at the end of the day, yeah, you can eat so much food, but is that food going is eating that food gonna save you? No. You know what I'm saying? It might keep you for another day. You know what I'm saying? If something else don't happen to you. So be 
being spiritual, having this word, having this bread, having the Lord, the, which is the word, that, that's the only way, man. All these other groups have all these crazy other ways that's not no way. You know what I'm saying? It, 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 it has no solution. But, but to getting out of here as the people, man. Right. Yeah, making, right. Can I say this side? Go ahead. They salute they solution is making a final deal with the white man that's gonna set us free. That's right. Haven't right. this nigga showed you in all these yeah. years that you his his word ain't worth shit? Yeah. That's right. What y'all talking about, we need to uh, be a proactive oh, community and what's that shit that that's they love to say? Sovereignty. Yeah. 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 Sovereign or they'll say uh, uh we yeah, need to uh, to move we us. need to basically put our money in our own community. Right. Okay. What community? But this is the point. If you if you were to build up the so-called black community, build our schools back up to teaching us our history, okay? If you were to do all these things, you're still missing the uh, the, the most important element, which is an army, which is force. You can't keep shit without force, bro. That's right. Every nation in the world got an army to back them in case some other nation comes right. and try to uh, and, and try to negate or deny their ass, man. Yeah. So, so, so you niggas ain't really serious about what you're saying because that's right. You ain't you ain't really about no real revolution, man. No, to get real respect, we gotta we gotta draw blood on the on, on more than a few of these so-called white people. That's right. Then they'll come at us just like they come at the Taliban. When you see them overseas, yeah, and, they, and, and, the, and, and the Taliban yeah. have a meeting at the UN, yeah. well, hold up, these motherfuckers and killed all these crackers, ain't? But you, but see, even though they upset with the Taliban, they, they still respect them as men yep. because they don't tolerate the bullshit, right, right? And they willing to die behind theirs. That's right. So you'll still sit down at a table with these people, man. That's tough. So, so. That's, that's the point I'm trying to make. You niggas ain't really serious, bro. Nope. And, and, and then second thing is the white man is falling, man. How the hell are we going to backdoor out the white man and go through his system to gain something when the Lord's about to destroy him? Yeah. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you don't believe in the Lord. Okay, well, well, the white man about to destroy himself. Do you do you not believe in that? Yeah. <laughs> but if you just look at all the fucking signs, he destroying his fucking self, man. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. So like I said, you got to have force and you got to be willing to stand behind it and, and, and fucking sacrifice the life of, of certain men, bro. I was I was reading in the Chronicles and it was speaking about the uh, 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 I think it was the Manasseh, the tribe of Manasseh, and how they stood all within their ranks. This is the time during the time of David, man. Oh, right. And it was talking about how mighty we was at war at that time. Right. And it said they all went forward in their ranks. And, and he said they they weren't double-minded, man. Meaning they weren't thinking about it. They was going off like kamikazes, ready to fucking die, man. Until we get men in Israel like fucking that, nigga, you ain't gonna get no motherfucking nation, nigga. But you know what, though? But you ain't got no niggas like that, man. That's right. That's right. But where's you niggas at? If I right, 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 right. Uh, you black power. They here, though. <laughs> yeah, where's you at? Most of win. That's us, though. We want right. to die for this thing. Right, 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 right. We're doing this on a righteous level, though, man. We're exactly. doing what the Most High do. Well, they, they, they don't like it because we're doing it in the order that the, that the, right. uh, the Most High say. Right. Right. It's like somebody get Zechariah uh, uh, chapter, uh, I think it's two. Yeah. Right. Go ahead if and bring I, out that priest. If I can say this real quick, they, they upset. Go ahead, go ahead. If I can say it real quick, just like, just like the point the brother's bringing out, like how you gonna be a sovereign nation when you ain't got shit to back you up? Just like with Gad, they thought they were sovereign. Look the fuck happened to them, man. Look what happened to Gad. They sitting on reservations. They barely have anything. You know, they barely, they barely have their lives right now. Zephaniah too. And they, and, and they thought they could come to the white man with treaties, and they thought they could talk to you him can't. sensibly. Hey, but hey, look hey, what happened. Hey, 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 you, you know can't. why? Look, then, you know why? I'm saying, you know why? Because there was missing one thing. The most high. That's right. Because the most high turned turn his face from them. That's right. Because the shit they were doing. Yeah. You need the most high along with your army. Yeah. That's what makes you win. Well, that's, well like, I, like I was you know saying, saying, I was reading the Chronicles, and each time we went out to battle, that's how the most high gave us the victory, man. Right. Uh, through, through the most high. Ain't no, ain't no Israel, the Israelites didn't put down their guns, so to speak, and shit like that, man. They went out with their weapons, which was made of them by the king's order. On the on, on the faith of the how about shim how shot and and he gave him victory man power to win so even like I say you niggas is missing the essential fucking element but then talking about you gonna build something nigga you ain't got no guns yeah. you got no heart you ain't got no yeah. army or no heart yeah even <laughs> the dad didn't have guns but they had heart they, 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 yep that's right that's right that's right and, and then, that's where guerrilla warfare came from man from Gad man. man they was in there battling doing their thing man the Gad didn't have any uh, uh, regulation of uh, uh, so called white men but they went out there and they fought like men yep. now you niggas got uh, 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 got history man 
you, you, you bring it up all the time. Yep. What, what, what a sign is that, bro? Which one, brother? You bring it up all the time? Yeah. Like how, the hell, how the hell are you going to try to uh, <laughs> uh, uh, be diplomatic with a man that hates you, man? Yeah. A man that sees you as uh, two thirds of a person, of a human being. Yep. A man that'll condone something like this, tell you to get over it. Yeah, don't worry about it, it's over. So you know you just gotta do if you talking about on a carnal level. Well, this this is the thing about get the, get that script of Zachariah. You know I mean, Zephaniah, Zephaniah. Zachariah. This, this this asshole claimed that oh you can't uh, uh the white man is not his devil man. But you talking about you gonna do all this wonderful shit for the community? Don't you know these devils are jealous of our people, man? Hold up, a, a, a black Wall Street in Oklahoma, man. What if they come and do to that? They came and destroyed that shit, man. What you talking about what you gonna do? You ain't gonna do shit without no army, man. You ain't gonna do shit unless you can shut somebody motherfucking mouth, man. You ain't gonna do a goddamn thing, man. Damn. Straight up, unless you, you, you got, get that script, read that script, man. Two I think it's eight. Zephaniah 2 and 8. I have heard the, I don't need that shit, but I'm reading it. I have heard the reproach of uh, Moab and the uh, rebellion of the children of Ammon, whereby they have reproached my people. Nah. I think it might be. Zechariah 2 and 8. What does I say if the Lord of hosts after the glory of Sam? Some real ooga booga. Yeah. Say, wait, yo, yo, yo. Goes up front your goddamn <laughs> head. You, so you got that exactly white right. people. You so-called white people got some motherfucking nerve, man. That's right. I know y'all getting on, this, on the brothers, the, the, the niggas right now. But you damn white people got some motherfucking nerve. I mean, we you getting so on that, everybody. Whoever so the script is touching, don't That's right, brother. You think, the, you think the whole world, that you're entitled to the whole world? Can't nobody tell you yeah. shit. You, you ain't nothing but an evil. Yeah. Fuck and this is the thing, they, they say that the so-called black man is entitled, you white people are entitled, man. You believe because you born white that you supposed to get all this wonderful shit, can't nobody talk to you this kind of way, you can lie and spread your lies across the world, the earth, man. Get on TV, act, 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 act a damn donkey, man, can't nobody judge you. You tell the black man to take responsibility, yet you haven't took responsibility for nothing that you did in the That's fucking right. earth, man, That's to this right. goddamn right. day, man. You got running. some fucking nerve for piece right. of shit. You still running around giving a bunch of goddamn excuses, motherfucker. That's right, man. Zechariah 2 and 8. But thus saith the Lord of hosts, after the glory hath he sent me unto the nations which spoil you. For he that toucheth you toucheth the apple of his eye. But behold, That's right. I will shake mine hand upon them. That's right. And they shall be a spoil to their servants. That's right. And you shall know that the Lord of hosts hath sent me. That's right. You gonna know in that day, man. That's right. That the Lord of the host, that the Lord of hosts, which is a, which means of armies, was was out here telling his men, bringing his men out here to prophesy these words unto you, man. And that we ain't coming at our heart, man. We ain't just a bunch of uh, 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 mad Negroes coming at our heart. We a bunch of mad Negroes coming with the truth, man, with reasoning, directing our anger, man. Like the Lord say, ain't be angry, angry and sin not, man. We directed it in the way of truth so we can tell our people what's to come, man. Go ahead. Sing and rejoice, O daughter of Zion. For lo, I come, and I will dwell in the midst of thee, That's saith right. the Lord. And many nations shall be joined to the Lord in that day. That's right, and they're going to be joined to us, but first we got to beat their ass first. That's right, brother. We got to beat them down first, because these white people ain't going to act right. They ain't going to bow down to the black men. But when we put our fists across their face, they're going to do that. They ain't going to have no choice. Because the Lord said he's going to be with us. He's going to defend us, man. So all that bullshit y'all been speaking for all these years is going gonna, is gonna to be void, man. Right. In that day, man. Because then the truth is going to be going to be gonna dwell. That's right. Ain't going to be no more denying the truth no more, man. Yeah. Yeah. Ain't gonna be no more trying to rewrite history, man. And cherry pick what you want to make you look good. Or to make you feel better, like like this right. bullshit we got coming up, man, with this Black History Month, man. This is such Same bullshit, shit. man. All y'all gonna talk about this entire month is Martin Luther King. That's it, y'all not gonna talk about shit else. But then, that's, this, this will show you what the devil they are. They gonna talk about him. And kill some and, more and, 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 and then they gonna try to, uh, 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 
whitewash his so-called legacy. Mm -hmm. But then, if you go into the truth about him, he was just a, a setup anyway, man. And and he had uh, open homosexuals <laughs> in his in his fucking uh, uh, congregation, man. right? And, and when you and go when you go right into in right this fucking uh, uh, speeches and everything, right? Yeah. When you when you go into integration, integration uh, is what killed our nation, man. Yeah. Because with with integration, we couldn't tell, we couldn't speak the truth to our people, man. We couldn't tell them their history, man. We couldn't uh, 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 so so called build an uh, uh, economic base for ourselves because this white man took all that away from us. Then then he propped up these fucking heathens to come in my neighborhoods and fucking get the businesses and and, 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 uh, and run the services that we supposed to be running for our fucking self. That's right. A nigga can't sit in a goddamn corner store and sell himself some fucking liquor, man. You want me to believe that shit? Right. Neither, neither is he uh, uh, in interested. That's bullshit. But what you do, you get these fucking heathens over here, and, and, and these motherfuckers be on a, a visa, a goddamn green card, but all of a sudden they, they got a business, man. Right. Yeah. Can't barely speak English. Yeah. Right. Hold up. They, they, they don't got no history with the bank. They ain't got no goddamn ancestry here, but they got a goddamn business in our fucking neighborhood. How that fucking happen? Because these white people that set up above these fucking banks get them charged to do that, man. Get that, get that, get the scriptures uh, in Deuteronomy, man. But how we'll uh, come, come, they'll come up high and we'll go down low. Yeah, that's true. So don't sit up here and tell me about oh Jake don't Jake know what the hell going on man. That's right. They didn't got so damn they didn't got used to it about you know. That's right, brother. They didn't got used to going there and seeing these damn heathens doing this man. To the point if they they pacified now. Now they going elsewhere to fucking get a piece, but you ain't gonna get a piece, man, until you get these heathens off your damn back. Go ahead. Revelations 18 and 4. I heard another voice from heaven saying, come out of her, my people, that ye be not partakers of her sin. Right, you're supposed to come out of America, the philosophies of this faggot ass nation. That's, that's right. right. So you do not partake in the destruction that's about to come to this place, man. That's right. You're supposed to come out of trying to be a goddamn Democrat and a Republican and a Christian and a Muslim and a feminist and an atheist, a Scientologist, a drug dealer, a gangbanger, an Egyptologist. Go ahead. It's in that ye receive not for place. That's right. For our sins have reached unto heaven. That's right. And, and the Lord is judging this place already, man. The place is going on already, man. There ain't no law out here. It's already anarchy, man. That's right. The, the, the politicians, the banks, they do what the hell they want to do. White These people. white people walk up on you and do what the fuck they want to do. The cops, they, they they pull you over whenever the hell they want to. Where's the law and order in America, man? Shit, they pulling you over. They, they shooting you and killing you now. They're, they're not now. They've always been doing Hold that. Hold up. These, 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 these uh, organizations, these corporations charging you what the hell they want to. Yep, they they add fees on top of fees. Everybody's charged for the internet. Come on, man. This place breaking down. Uh, as we already see, it's breaking down, man. That's right. Okay, I got you. But the only the only people that still believe in this place is our people and these so-called white people, man. Right. Why? Because they proud, man. Go ahead. Come on, this is Jeremiah chapter 2, verse 26. As the thief is ashamed when he is found, right. so is the house of Israel That's ashamed. Right. So so as the thief is ashamed when he is found, so is the house of Israel, man. We were ashamed. We've been ashamed because we were found going off from the law, man. Right. We were found idolizing, man. We were found trying to be all off from these other nations' ass, man. Trusting in oppression. Trusting in oppression, like the brother said, man. Right. Trusting in a nation that could not save you, man. Yeah. <laughs> Go ahead. They, their kings, their princes, and their priests, and their prophets, saying to a stock, thou my father right. and to a stone thou hast brought me forth for they have turned their back unto me right that's the that's that that's all the philosophies besides our philosophy 
Because we don't the worship time. nothing, man. Ain't no symbol to symbolize this truth, bro. Right. Come it on. ain't no one symbol you can put up that we're going to look at that and bow down to that and say that that's the truth, man. That's right. So that's you niggas, man. What, 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 walk around with a fucking eye horse on your damn cheek, man. Pineal gland. <laughs> you idolize it, man. You know what, dude? Walking around with pyramids and shit. That, that's a building, man. You idolize it, man. Go ahead. Oh, God. For they have turned their back unto me, and not their face. Right. But in the, in the time of their trouble, they will say, Arise and save us. That's right. And that's what the Israelites did going all throughout history, man. Going back to when the, uh, the northern tribes broke off from us, man. They were worshiping them idols real hard. Every time they'll get in trouble, they'll come back to the Lord, man. Yup. And then they judges and judges, man. Yeah, they're all doing all day. Like on some old stupid ass shit, man. Why did y'all just do that in the first place? Yep. Because y'all were looking outside for some uh, 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 oh the grass is green on the other side, man. Yeah. Type shit, man. That these other nations don't got, man. Like Amaziah, uh, 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 I think his name was the king. Who destroyed the Edomites? Then took the guys and yeah, worshipped yeah. them, man. What the yeah. fuck was that guy thinking yeah. about, man? Just like uh, when the, after, uh, after King Solomon died and the two and the two kingdoms split, I can't think of which one. Uh, it was a, it was an Ephraimite king, Rehoboam. Rehoboam got the rest of the uh, got the rest of the Israelites to come across him, uh, come with him, cause he brought them two fucking golden calves out. Right. Cause y'all was secretly worshiping them other guys. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. Y'all to pray to the Most High every time y'all start getting y'all ass dog. But then as soon as you get to a position to where you was comfortable, you go right. Back yeah, to worshiping yeah, yeah. them idols, and right, the same man. shit is going on today. That's Give right. it, yeah. Time. Give it. Right. Hold up. World, we, we in poverty. We uh, everybody drank into this Bible, right? Even though they don't know the Bible, yeah. But they got a zeal, a zeal, right? But then when they get some goddamn some 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 fucking money or some recognition from some of these crackers, all of a sudden they're Scientologists, like Will Smith and shit. Yep. All of a sudden they are Buddhists, man. Y'all y'all do that on this side, man. You go from one era. And, and then you and then you start airing all over the fucking place, man. Because you 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 in Hollywood or you a basketball star or something like that, man. Remember, bro, quick that nigga Pete did he jump to the Bible when he got in trouble? Yep. That nigga jumped to the Bible quick. <laughs> you niggas are full of shit. Yeah, yeah, as soon as he, as soon as everything was all good, he went back to living his little hip hop life. He went right back to dragging blood and sucking cock. That's right, man. Look at all kill him. That nigga did the same. That nigga came out with a whole church album. Yeah. <laughs> oh, look, that's what that's what Martin Luther King was doing. Cause he was down with the boule, if you in case you didn't know. Yep. Which that ain't of the most high. Where it say you gonna go get down with the boule, become a preacher, and lead your people. You see what I'm saying? So that nigga ain't right. Go ahead. But where are thy gods that thou hast made thee? Let them arise if they can save thee in the time of thy trouble. For according to the number of thy cities are thy powers, O Judah. Right, so basically, I was looking up some archaeology, man, in, in, in Israel, and they were digging up all type of fucking goddesses and shit with breasts and titties and shit. This is all documented, man. They didn't dug up the, uh, the the proof on you Negroes, man. That was all you was doing, man. Till this day, that's all you do. You want to do whatever you see everybody else do, when everybody else ain't winning like 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 you would win if you would follow the Most High. Cause he'll give everything unto us, just like that. And these white people, they had to steal and connive to get everything they got. And they had to be a bunch of heartless, godless goddamn demons in the earth to get where they got. And they still losing. All the riches they done stole, everything can't hold them up, man. They still falling. All the lies they done told, the truth still coming out. White supremacy couldn't hold them up. All so all that bullshit that these crackers and pushed all these years, they still going down, man. So what does that tell you, man? Don't follow in the way of the so-called white man, the Edomites. Come back to the truth. But polite in the black conscious community, they want to follow in the way of the Edomites. Well, let's go here and do this, dabble in this, dabble in that. Let's open this up, open this up. Let's just be, let's just be people of many offices and shit, man. That ain't gonna get you nowhere. Like I say, if you, uh, you want to, uh, the main thing you need to be doing is getting some Negroes some guns together. You're going to do anything. Yeah. Then you'll be able to back up some of the shit you can say 
Yeah. And then even though you're going to lose the initial war, anyway, right. you're going to lose the initial war, but at least they're going to know at that point, bro. You Y'all ain't serious, man. Shit, you you gotta teach man. niggas to shoot first. <laughs> 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 niggas ain't going to train. Shoot, niggas ain't, niggas ain't serious, bro. <laughs> this is what you said they stood up for something, man. All right, right. right. Can I say this, too? Because even that nigga uh, Malcolm X, man, he made a good point, man. I seen in his interview. He was like, a man can't beg another man or ask permission from another man for his freedom, for his sovereignty, man. Right. The only way that a man gonna achieve any type of sovereignty or freedom is by death, man. It's gonna have to be some type of bloodshed. So all you niggas talking about revolution, man, you niggas ain't on no revolution, man, because you niggas ain't willing to die for what you believe in, man. You niggas just swifting and drifting to everywhere in the doctrine that sound good, mainly for these funky hoes, man. Hey, they on that Alex Jones shit, that yeah. info war. We gonna win by the info war. Yeah. You ain't gonna win by the Alex. info war, Alex. Y'all gonna have to uh, 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 lock and load, man. Ain't gonna be no 17. It ain't gonna be no no peaceful revolution. That's that's a lie. That ain't never happened yeah. in history, yeah, man. It never will. Right, right, right. Never happened in history, man. That's right. So like I said, they just they keep showing themselves to go on the ways of this devil, man. Deep away. These niggas want to go deep outside the scriptures. Well, you go and you petition <laughs> and you beg and you chant and you and, and you and you pop up in Capitol Hill and surprise them and all that. that that's that's a game. That's a cat and mouse game, man. They run and you come and then they go hide, duck off somewhere else, and you wait and they pop up again and you meet them at a motherfucking voting thing and all that. That's all bullshit, man. Then they come up and then they give a speech and then they go back a fucking way. Well, what the fuck is that gonna do for our nation, man? That's right. While we sitting around, people still ain't got jobs. We still ain't we still ain't got our own food, our own land. We still ain't got our own our own uh, habitations, man. What the hell's that gonna do, man? That's just gonna get, bring our people, like his brother saying, the more confusion, man. At the, at the while we at the end of this place, you telling us to recoup, regather, and, and come with another plan, and then get the white man to vouch for us. What the? <laughs> that ain't gonna happen, man. Go ahead, I. It's Isaiah chapter five, verse thirteen. Therefore, my people are gone into captivity because they have no knowledge. That's right. Mm. And their honorable men are famished. That's and their right. multitude. The honorable men are famished, man. Okay, the men, the men that had the truth, the Lord took the truth away from them back then. He had to give it, give it back to us. And now uh, the men of Israel call themselves honorable. Y'all famished, man. Polite, you famished, man. You ain't got no truth. You void, man. You ain't got no water. You dry in a bitch. That's why you can't be found right now, man. You dry in the hole. You ain't got nothing else. But then when you come back, you gonna come back with some shit that the white man said. Yep. Some new bullshit, man. Cause you ain't got nothing else. What you got against the Bible, man? What you got against the truth? The word of the Lord is tried, bro. Y'all can talk all that bullshit all you want. Go ahead. Go ahead. Psalm 62 and 10. Trust not in oppression and become not vain in robbery. In right. Richard. Trust not in oppression. That's America about oppressing you. About beer, 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 uh, making everything bureaucratic, yeah, man. Yeah. Making a big ass bureaucracy where you got to get permission from this devil to do everything, man. Yeah, to do anything. Yeah. That ain't that ain't freedom. That's oppression, man. But you want to build our people up in this, man. That's your solution. Go ahead. If riches increase, set not your heart upon them. Right. If, 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 hey, if you do get a little money on this side, don't set your heart upon it because that ain't going to save you. That ain't going to save you, man. The Lord is coming to destroy this damn dollar, man. This dollar ain't shit, bro. It ain't going to last. It's just a, a few coupons for you to get what the fuck you got to get right now. You work for it. Yeah. Then you didn't the, the white man give them to you and say you can go and you can buy shit at my stores now. Yeah. And so you go and you, you get the money, money right back to this motherfucker with interest, and now you owe more than what you ever got in the goddamn first place. How the fuck is that righteous, yeah, man? Yeah. You niggas trust in oppression. Y'all yeah. ain't talking about getting a gold back motherfucking money system, right. but you talking about building a community. How you gonna do that? Well, you, you ain't gonna system. get a new money system? Yeah, without a monetary <laughs> system. But you know what? You know you ain't gonna get. You ain't gonna be able to get a monetary system without power, man. That's right. Hey, without having uh, 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 guns and arms. 
Because they're not going to respect your right, dollar if you don't have that. That's out the pocket. Can I say something? Go ahead. They're talking about getting the gold and all that. They're talking about tax season. That's what they're talking about. Get back right. What's your tax season? Right. Get back right. That's what they You niggas don't look, like brother said, you don't look for a, 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 a final solution. You look for a goddamn band aid. Every goddamn year, that band aid fall off. You gotta right. get a new band aid. And you gotta regroup. Man. You gotta regroup. You gotta cook this huddle back up. <laughs> And you have yet to deal, you have yet to deal with your enemy face to face is the reason why you're in the position you're in. Right, right. You come back to the Lord, deal with your fucking enemy, the Lord gonna help you. He gonna help us. That's in the scriptures, bro. He gonna help us. But y'all don't wanna do it that way, man. That's right. Deuteronomy 28, 48. Therefore, shalt thou serve thine enemies, which the Lord shall send against thee in hunger and in thirst. And in nakedness, and in one of all things. Right, and we are in one of all things at this point, man. Still, still, to this day, still. Everybody that do, everybody that has anything to do with the black community, with making money off us, selling anything to us, don't look like us. They all come from other places, man. Right, the weave industry, the uh, clothes industry, the shoes, whatever you can think, whatever you can think about, bro. We don't control none of that, man. Go ahead. And he shall put a yoke of iron upon thy neck until he have destroyed thee. Right, and that's, and that's prophecy, man. How he put the yoke of iron around the men's neck, okay, to, to destroy them. Because you couldn't run away with that yoke of iron on your neck. You couldn't get nowhere, man. And it was to make you look like shit. It was to bring you down low, which that's what happened to our people, man. That's right, brother. If I can add this, it's also spiritual though. Yeah. That, that spiritual yoke of iron, you're not getting out of the clutches of so called white right. man right now. Yeah, right. You don't have no fucking power right. to do anything. Neither. Ex without the will of Yahweh Bashim Al Shah, you ain't got shit, bro. That's right. That's it. Right. It right. Yeah, they on the spiritual yeah, yoke, man. Thinking they going to dig their way out, man. You were stopping when you ever been, man. You ain't digging your way out of this. The Lord gave you one way out. Niggas by by, yeah. by, by, by yeah. salvation yeah. or fire yeah. or destruction. Yeah. Ain't no in between. Ain't nothing else, bro. You gonna get beamed up or burnt up. You gonna get beamed up or burnt yeah. up, man. <laughs> I mean, but if you look at your at the situation, yo, you on an individual level and uh, on a, on a, a grand scheme of things, look at our people, man. That's the only that's the only turn that we got, man. Put the the push the restart button, man. Right. <laughs> and for the elect to get out of here, man. Right. There ain't no coming back, man. Look at our people, man. Our people are faggots, dirty, wicked, stupid. Murderers, abortion, killers, <laughs> adulterers. Man, I mean, it don't stop, man. The list goes on, man. That's right, brother. It says our, our deeds have oh, uh, the, the, well, not uh, our the right deeds yeah. over uh, 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 overpass the deeds of the wicked, man. Hey, and our people are a bunch of fucking cowards at that, man. That's right, brother. So, our people cower, man. That's right. Y'all find any reason to cower, bro. That's yeah, right, man. brother. Y'all a bunch of fucking cowards talking about you gonna build. You're not gonna build anything, man. Yeah, man. You got you got one way out, bro. That's it. Isaiah chapter 30 verse 1. Woe to the rebellious children, said the Lord, that take counsel, but not of me. Right, you taking counsel of everything you can find, bro. Whether it be from the, uh, 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 what, what, what's those articles that this guy brought up? Yeah. Sarah Sue said he's. Uh, the, uh, some shit, man. Yeah. That Egyptology shit. Whatever you go into, bro. Read that scripture again. Yeah, yeah. Isaiah 30 and 1. Woe to the rebellious children, said the Lord, that take counsel, but not of me, and with, and that cover with a covering, but not of my spirit. Right, man. Y'all talking about building communities. The Lord said he's going to destroy America and the white man. Now, if you would have took counsel of the Lord, you, all you got to do is go in the scriptures and read it for yourself, man. But but we telling you these things, but you oh, we just a bunch of dumb niggas, man. You ignore the words that we say. And then you go look in other places, man. Like other places got any truth. Then you try to throw it back in our face. Oh, that's that's written by a man. When you going into a book written by a man right. Right. that just fucking got off the goddamn bus in New York. Yeah, written by a nigga from Harlem. Show me a book that ain't written by a man. Right, show me a book that ain't written by a man, nigga. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That book written itself. That book written itself. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, like, like y'all got, like got a book that was written from the sun. That was passed down from generation to generation. Right. Yeah, the, sun, right. the sun wrote a book. 
the sun, the sun do do uh, uh, stellar nuclear synthesis uh, created atoms, which created books, which uh, which created a book that had uh, created its own writing, and it, and, it, and this will happen. You got it in the middle of Harlem. No, nigga. <laughs> Basically, you niggas ain't shit, man. <laughs> Breathe in. <laughs> yeah, man, I'm ruthless to ass niggas, man. Oh, man. That they may add sin to sin, Bruce. that want to go down into Egypt, <laughs> and that want to go down into Egypt, man. Like our people got a close relationship with Egypt, and they don't want to let it go. All throughout history, y'all went back and forth into Egypt for many different reasons, man. Yep. Not just because of displacement and captivity. You went back just because, just because of the economy. You want to make a way down there. Just like niggas come over here to America. Y'all, it's many reasons. Y'all want y'all just love, y'all like the scenery, man. You like the way of the Egyptians. You like the what they do. You like well, their gods. They're into the spiritual Egypt too, which is America. Right. They into spiritual Egypt and Babylon, which is spiritually Egypt and Sodom, man. You into that shit too. You right. into being a faggot. Right, right, right. You into uh these different philosophies. Democrat or Republic. Democrat Repu all that right. bullshit, man. You into uh uh being a Pentecostal right. at church and running around the goddamn uh church catching up. Catching what you call the Holy Ghost, and passing out of shit. <laughs> which is the way of the Egyptians. Holy smokes! <laughs> that ain't our way. That's the way of the Egyptians, man. That's right. <laughs> but their solution is how we get out of this situation is pretend like we like the other nations. We ain't like the other nations, bro. Let's act like them and be like them, and then just make that ain't gonna happen, man. Nigga, get some fort, get some guns behind you, nigga. If you're gonna do any goddamn thing, man, that they gonna actually take notice of. The white man has proved he don't believe in nothing but pain and death, man. If you give his ass that, then all of a sudden he wanna sit down and do a deal with you, man. Go ahead. Uh, that want to go down to Egypt and have not asked at my mouth to strengthen themselves in the strength of Pharaoh and to trust in the shadow of Egypt. Right, man, you trusting in the shadow of Egypt when you dealing here in America, man. Every day you gotta remind yourself to put off the bullshit of this place, bro. That's right, that's right. That's Cause right. it's all it's all fucking vain and stupid as hell, bro. It's gonna be burnt up. And then on top of that, everybody wants to just get a woman all this damn power all of a sudden, man. Therefore shall the strength of Pharaoh be your shame. And the trust in the shadow of Egypt, your confusion. That's right, and you're gonna be ashamed of this place, just like you was ashamed of Egypt, man. And this place is gonna be your confusion, man. Cause the Lord, like I say, he breaking this place down. And he gonna break it down unto nothing. Then what y'all gonna do? What's gonna be your solution? Yeah. Let's go beg the fucking FEMA people yeah. with all the hey, guns and FEMA, shit. FEMA. FEMA. To, uh, let's do a deal for our nation, man. They gonna wrap, they gonna gather our ass up, man. And it's gonna be on at that point. Yeah. Or, or, or ask the woman God to save you. Yeah, man. Like I always say, you gonna, on, you gonna, gonna when the time comes, you gonna run in the house. <laughs> Baby Keisha, <laughs> these niggas out here shit. Come on. Hey, how you, how you, how you gonna, how you gonna build up the community with the damn chip, man? With the, with the, the white man is pushing the chip. How you gonna build up a community with that? This man, he getting ready to change the whole damn monetary system, man. Yeah. But you talking about what you gonna do? You ain't gonna do nothing, man, unless nothing. you shield yourself from that. Hold on real quick. I'm glad you said that. I heard a report on the news. They got this new thing now. Now, America is the only, is, is like the only, I think is the only country or maybe one of only two countries that when you use a credit card, they use a magnetic strip. Everywhere else in the world, they use what's called chip and pin. There's a reporter for NPR that he moved, he's now, he's the corresponding reporter in London. He can't even use his credit card because it doesn't work. So he had to get a, a, a international, you know, he had to get a bank account that has this new system, chip and pin system, man. Okay, now check this out. Y'all heard about this whole thing with Target, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, man, that's, that shit is all a ploy, man. That's right. Cause I, I, and the reason I know yes. is because I work for a company, you know, I work for a company that deals with payments and all of that, man. All right. Well, they didn't really lose a lot of money. They, 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 
a lot of their customers had their card information compromised. Okay? So now what they're doing is they're pushing this chip and pin system. Okay? Which goes into what this brother is talking about. So what you gonna, Nate, what you gonna tell your, your congregants, man? That's right. What you gonna tell them, man? Yohanna, well, I ain't worried about Yohanna. You somewhere on smack. I was say shit, yeah. yeah. He, he, he ain't gonna be nowhere to be found when I ask the question. I need some smack bird. <laughs> Eating heroin. Pass right. me my spoon yeah, bird. He, he don't look right. He don't look right. Now, that, that's why the elders are getting on you, Tazar, y'all. And I said it weeks ago, man. You gotta stop fucking lollygagging, man, and come on the right side, man. You know who's telling the truth, man. How you gonna follow somebody that's gonna sit there and say he don't gotta go out no more? All he do is manage the camp, man. That's a bitch ass nigga, man. That's a that's a whole yeah. ass bitch, man. For you to allow that, <laughs> man. When you read those old stories of them, of them Greeks going to war, going to war, them generals you was on the front lines, man. With with, with them people, man. How you don't lead by being in the back and managing shit. You lead by example, man. The kings of Israel, man. The kings of Israel threw they self in the mix, man. The Most High gonna find you idle. He's gonna find you idle. He's gonna be extremely displeased. Mm -hmm. He's gonna kill you. Oh, that's Matthew. Where it's say, time, uh, it's not time to be idle in this truth, man. Yeah. It's time to, to, to come out here and push this thing forward. To proclaim the word of the Heavenly Father, man. That's right. Yeah. It's time to glorify Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shah. Not, right. not sit, sit in the back. Right. You know? And, 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 uh, and, a, and a lot of brothers have that, that problem. They want to be idle. You don't want to work. You don't want to do nothing. The most I don't like that. He don't want men like that. He want men that is come coming out here ready to work, man. Doing the things, growing, man. Having that unction for perfection. That's right. Having that, having that zeal. That's not an example of zeal. That's not an example of fervor for the most high. All that excuse making and all that BSing, man, is gonna come to an end very soon. That's right. Okay? Cause you're, in, you, you basically you're getting tired, man. You got it. What you got? Bring it down now. It's uh, Romans 12 and 1. I beseech you therefore, brethren, by the mercies of God, that you present your bodies a living sacrifice. Yeah, man. Present your body a living sacrifice. Not send somebody else out That's, to do it yeah. for you. Not tell somebody else, hey, hey, go, go, can you go do mine too? Huh? <laughs> you gotta present your body as a living sacrifice. Not your orders and your commands. Yo. Know? <laughs> Dad, once again, man, y'all allowing all these excuses being made, you go on with your sense instead of the sense of the scriptures. The scriptures told you what we're supposed to be doing. How you let him trick you that quick? Yeah, yeah, real fast. <laughs> that easy. You know? But we ain't supposed to say nothing. That ain't, you know. Holy, acceptable unto God. That's not acceptable unto the Most High. That's not holy. All right? Go ahead. Which is your reasonable service. That's your reasonable service. That's the least you could do, your huh? It's your wicked thing. ass. <laughs> it's a light thing. The least you could do is get your ass up and go out and preach. Yeah. Bullshit on God dang it, man. That's some bullshit that y'all believe in, man. Nigga is chilling. Go <laughs> ahead. And be not conformed to this world, but be ye transformed. Yeah, man. You, 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 you trying to sit up like Elijah Muhammad or somewhere on some goddamn high, high horse, man. Ain't no pun intended. Oh, you're a high horse. <laughs> I need that spoon bird. Oh, man. might be dying. By the renewing of your mind, uh -huh. that ye may prove what is the good, uh -huh. the acceptable, uh -huh. and perfect will of God. All right, man, that takes action to do it, man. You got to be doing stuff. You got to work. You got to present that information. Got to do it. Okay? 
okay? Can I get second thoughts on all this? Hey, you know what? Was the, I'm go sorry, go ahead, go ahead. No, no, you make you make your point. But I, no, I'm glad you said that. My daughter, you know, I teach my daughter how to fight. She thought when she started learning how to box, she she was automatically gonna hit the pad and start punching and doing all this. I got, I, you know, I did it old school style. Uh, I got the stick out, and all she did the first, the first session, head moving. Yeah, head moving yeah. until it hurt. Cause that's those are the fundamentals. Yeah, foot yeah. movement, head movement. You know, strength training. The stuff that you right. that you need. Then we can get. See, cause y'all want to jump to the fun stuff. See what you don't understand. Knocking what y'all see. Out. Yeah, yeah. Knocking, knocking people jump, out, knocking picking people, people apart, and yeah. all that. You can't get to picking people apart if you don't know how to move your goddamn head. Adrian Broner. Adrian Broner. If you standing flat footed, you ain't got no footwork. You can't get to the fun part until you get get through the fundamentals, man. And you ain't even doing the fundamentals. But you got your people out there going and doing the hard work for you, man. Yep, yep. The Lord gonna destroy you, nigga. Yep. And what I was gonna say is, how is the only man chosen to bring back Israel not gonna be out there teaching them, man? He's idol. The only man. That's what y'all say. General Yohanna, the only man chosen. Jake can't never just leave it at something, man. Jake gotta yeah. go too goddamn yeah. far. The yeah. comforter. The only man chosen to bring back the nation of Israel, man. And ain't not one of them doing teaches, shit. He only teaches <laughs> special right. requests. Right. They about, they're about titles, having having long titles and shit, you know? This is this is our count of power. Uh, 1 Corinthians 15 and 9. For I am the least of the epistles, uh, that I am not uh, meet to be called an apostle, because I, per I persecuted the church of the Most High, but by the grace of the Most High, I am what I am. And his grace which was bestowed upon me was not in vain, but I labored more abundantly than they all. But I labored more abundantly, abundantly than they all. Labor, work, labor, and that's how. Yeah, that's, how, that's really how you can see that the, 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 the elders, the uh, great millstone, what people call it, are are, are really pushing forth truth, man. Yep. Because no one is laboring like this. No, no. You can't. You Bonafide. can't. You can't even try to come up against it. Yeah. It's so overwhelming. The amount of labor and work, and then their then their students. Their, their, the their children are doing the same, man. Yep. If you go and look look on YouTube, who, what videos do you see? We teach you how to you see the, life. We see you the el you see the elders, and then you see their children. Yep. Right. We teach you that you're an Israelite. And every now and then you might see a fucking asshole like Nate. Yep. Or an asshole like the, the new nigga that popped up, Fopi. Yep. For our people's oh, yeah, education. Yeah, yeah. You get the breakdown from GMS. Plain and simple. You and, get every, the and, then, and then really, once every blue moon, you see them dumbass Pan-African niggas arguing in Harlem trying to pussy bag every goddamn woman that walks by with some goddamn African braids and shit, man. Yeah. 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 <laughs> trying to set up another debate. Oh, no, natural to Hootie, man. Oh, he, he, I mean, that's the ultimate pussy bag if I ever yeah. seen yeah. one, man. Oh, <laughs> He smoked cigarettes. Bet <laughs> <laughs> you that nigga smoked cigarettes. <laughs> yeah, not I, but the grace of the Most High, which was with me. Yeah, but by the grace of the Most High, man, that was with him, he labored more abundantly. Which we should be, we should be emulating that from Paul, because he was a, he was a man of the Lord. Follow right. Me. Okay. Go ahead. Second Thessalonians three and one. Finally, brethren, pray for us that the word of the Lord may have free course and be glorified. Uh, the, the word of the Lord, in order for the word of the Lord to be uh, glorified, you got to go out and teach it to the people so they can do it. It's got to have free course. And yeah, free course mean we don't hold back that's nothing, exactly man. Right. That's exactly right. The word come out. The word come out. Uh huh. One day we talking about the white man. One day we talking about the black woman. Mm -hmm. 
One day we talking about everybody, man. Yeah, talking about, oh, they always getting on somebody. That's what the Bible about. <laughs> correction. How the hell, yeah, it's correction and telling you what's going to come, man. That's ain't right. about telling you doing everything great and shit. That's and right. then we go home. Yeah. What, the fuck would, what the fuck would be our job then? That's right. The Lord was, our, our, our job is to, is, is, is to set everything in correction. Okay? So you got to go out there and labor to do that. Go ahead. Even as, even as it is with you, and that we may be delivered from unreasonable and wicked men. Yeah, man. We ask you to be, watch out for these niggas, man. Yup. That's right. Are they unreasonable and wicked. Yep. And wicked. Because they won't listen to the word of the Heavenly Father. That's they right. can't follow simple instruction. Read. For all men have not faith, but the Lord is faithful. The Lord is faithful. Bubble eyes, you ain't got no faith. Uh, 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 uh. Nate, you damn sure ain't got no faith. That's right, man. All right? And Yohanna, you ain't got no faith, man. You tired. Shit. Be uh, tired, dog. You tired. Proof of that, Nate don't get into prophecy, man. That's, That's the main right. job, to get into prophecy, man. It's your main job. Yeah. You going into damn what happened to Israel Family. in the 400 years we was here, like yeah. that's it. Yeah. You don't get into the time before that. Yeah. You, don't get into shit. you don't get into history, history. You just get into America, man. Yeah. Doing good with your wife at home. <laughs> right. yeah. Yeah, man. What, what happened to our people? Uh, what, just, the, just the random, vague, vague, vague stuff, man. Yeah. Stuff that don't make no direct point, that don't hit home to nothing, man. Right. And then on top of that, you don't get into no profits and you don't yeah. get into no breakdown. So that's how we know, nigga, you, a, you a nigga, man. That's right. Yeah. And he tap dance around all yeah. the prophecies. Boy, he is because, man. because conveniently, you know, he not allowed to teach him. That's right. 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 The chip yeah. is everything but what it is. Both sides got to be locked in on their don't know him anyway. way of life, man. And that's just how it's prescribed. Agreement. Right. You can't be a prophet and don't want to deal with controversy, man. Yeah. Oh, just one second. For all men have not faith, but the Lord is faithful, who shall establish you and keep you from evil. And we have confidence in the Lord touching you, that ye both do and will do the things which ye, which we command you. You will do the, those things. Go ahead. And the Lord direct your hearts into the love of God. And into the patient waiting for Christ. Now we command you, brethren. Now, not not fleeing up out of here. Go ahead. Now we command you, brethren, in the name of our Lord, Yahweh Shah Masiyat. In the name, go ahead. That we withdraw yourselves from every brother that walk of disorderly. And we don't withdraw you withdraw yourselves from, from niggas that don't want to do right, man. That's right. Right. They walk in disorder. What's the brother name that's in ISUP? Yeah, I'm sorry. Cesaria. 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 Refrain your. Get, get away from that person, man. Stop lollygagging, man. Hey, oh, man, you, you brothers in GMS, if you got niggas like that in your camp, right. get them niggas out your camp. Bye, man. nigga. We an example of that. Hold let the niggas stay around. They ain't right to stay around too damn long, man. Yeah. Now he on the comment board talking shit. He, he's just a poison to the spirit of the heavenly father, man. Right. Everything that happens around him is chaos, disorder, hate. Hey, and since we, and since we, you know, since we went ahead and did what the fuck we had to do, this camp is this, this camp is flourishing. Right. That was and the worst I mean, time you know, our camp. All that brothers, brothers, <laughs> you know, got everybody got something to 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 be able to build up on, but. Ever since then, man, the camp is flourishing in the spirit of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh man. That's right. Yeah. Jeremy, yeah. Jay Dog, he was an you infection. bitch ass nigga, you. Right. Ooh, I wish you come to, man. Let me tell you something, man. I'll horse kick you, nigga. I'll horse kick your bitch ass. All right? Yeah, man. He Take one of them jumping, jumping rice, jumping rice grains on your bitch ass, man. I'll turn you into jumping rice grains, you bitch ass nigga. Oh, yep. and, and all you brothers in these camps, man, you got brothers. That ain't on point, man. Gotta get don't on. study, don't read, don't want to do nothing, make an excuse, don't ever want to go out. Always fucking arguing and talking back when he can do a simple task. Don't help nobody. Bye -bye. Beat the concrete. Get that nigga out of your camp, Agitate man. Agitate the gravel. Yeah, I want to say, ain't, no, I wanna say, ain't nobody gonna hold, we ain't holding you niggas hostage, man. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. If you don't like the way, if you don't like the way the Heavenly Father set it up, 
to, to do, then leave. Yeah, man. That's what I'm saying. Ain't nobody gonna be mad at you. That's what I'm yeah, saying. Man. You got to worry about that. Ain't nobody gonna hold no pistol to your head and try to get you to be righteous. Now you get the hell out the way. Yep. Every time you look up, you got a nigga. I was saying, every time somebody get kicked out the camp, they all want to get on the comment board. And, well, it was like this. Is this a dictatorship? You goddamn right, it's a dictatorship. But guess what? The Heavenly Father's plan, nigga. But guess what? They always fizzle out. Right. You niggas always. What happened to all your goddamn sit downs, J Dog? You, you. I mean, nigga, he, he was profound for like a day. The fatherhood. Yeah. The, the fatherhood. <laughs> and that, you know, that's the spirit. Yeah. That's the spirit. Because you are a part of the fatherhood. <laughs> bothering me. <laughs> you, oh, man. you bothering niggas, I'm man. Burden. You're I'm a goddamn burden. Damn burden, man. Damn burden, man. Damn burden. Niggas like that are a burden. Your general, your honey, and your camp is a burden. They're a part of the fatherhood. Spots in your feet. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like a Jew. Spots yeah. in your feet. Spots in your feet. You gotta get, kick them niggas out of camp, man. They hold man. back progress, man. Niggas, uh, uh, now they complain because we go out because it's cold and it's cold outside. God damn, Come y'all on, gonna man. complain about everything? Right. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. Try to do a sit follow. down to the Italian. Damn, okay, you niggas hating on that too. <laughs> Y'all ain't got no works, man. Yeah, yeah, come. That's why we were afraid from y'all. Oh, but it tells you in the scriptures that, that the men of the Lord, the elect, it say they works do follow them. That's right. Man. Yep. So don't you can't how you gonna get mad at a man that's speaking to our people in Italian? That's crazy. That's <laughs> fucking crazy, man. Oh, how you gonna get y'all. mad at a man that's speaking to our people in Spanish, that's crazy, man? Bro. And then a nigga got nigga said something to me because because of how I was pronouncing the French. Wow. Because I can pronounce French. Well, you know what? A vet monk kill. <laughs> I hate you. Right. God. God. <laughs> so, 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 the most I'm telling us people who are whack as fuck, man, get them, do, don't, man, get them away from you, man. All right? Right, bro. The scripture says, let's right. go mark them. Let's go pay on their ass, man. Watch their ass. See if they get right. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, if you, if you right, watch them, if you get lost. Everyone say if you watching them and they ain't doing right, you gotta get rid of them, man. Mm-hmm. You gotta get rid of them. Yep. You can't hold on. You can't hold on to niggas. I was say like Erica Boss say, ain't no niggas gonna make it like that. Nope. That's right. You know what I'm saying? I was like, that was say, why? Why you think people get kicked out these camps, man? Cause they being niggas. If you don't want to stop being a nigga, you don't have to. You don't have to stop being a nigga if you don't want to. If being a nigga is so important to you, then do your thing. <laughs> Shit. Yeah. I, want say, I want to say one of the happiest days of my life was when I found that I ain't had to be a nigga no more. <laughs> Shit. That's right. That's right. Fucking clowns. <laughs> you got it hurry out. And not after, uh, verse 6, and not after the tradition which he received of us. For yourselves. That's not how you act there out of the tradition, uh, the tradition which you received of us, man. Which comes from the words of the Heavenly Father. Go ahead. Going out to speak, that's a tradition. <laughs> yeah, going out to speak, that's a tradition. You gotta preach, right? <laughs> With all long suffering? That's right. No. Without ceasing. <laughs> Without ceasing. Go ahead. For yourselves know how ye ought to follow us. But we behave not ourselves disorderly among you. We didn't behave ourselves disorderly among you. We told you what to do. We did what we said. We're doing what we said. Go ahead. Neither did we eat any man's bread for naught. Uh-huh. We're brought with labor and travail. They didn't eat for naught, but with labor and travail that they eat. They just live like corn. Now you got this guy, uh, 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 Johanna, he don't even want to go out. That's not eating with labor and travail. <laughs> Go ahead. Night and day. Uh-huh. That we might not be chargeable to any of you. See, the elders are not chargeable like General uh, uh, Gehenna is being charged bring right them up now. On charges. Cause they are night and day, laboring with travail. Mm-hmm. Even when they had the flu. <laughs> Even when they were sick. Like they said, they had a hunger. All right. Go ahead. Not because we have not power, mm-hmm. but to make ourselves. Not because we, not because we don't have power, man. Right. Yeah. Because really they could, right? Just yeah. eat. Yep. Go ahead. Yep. But to make ourselves an example unto you to and follow even, us. Let me say this. Even, even the elders up there that, that, that you know, get 
um, get help from from the camp, the different camps all over the country, and even the main camp up there in New York. They don't abuse that, man. I sat, I witnessed it myself with my own eyes, man. Yep. They don't abuse that. Don't but you know what? I don't feel no type of way if, if an elder is getting help. From the, I don't feel no type of way, man. You should be thinking like that, man. You, yeah, but see, here's the thing, y'all. Y'all want to spend all this money on bullshit, on debates, on uh, uh, Passovers, and and, uh, and all this. First of all, why you gonna have a ticket to the Passover? Right. Just get, just get it, just get enough money for for the uh, for the lamb or the room if y'all want to uh, for the room if you want to rent a room. Um, for the wine. For the, uh, if you don't have a a a a, 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 a shapar or a ram's horn, you know, a a a, a, a manara, you know, uh, just enough to get everything that you need, man. Y'all be trying, cause it's not a party, man. It's a solemn assembly, man. It's a solemn assembly. Yeah, but y'all make the scriptures into something else that that you the way you want it to be. You're willful. Okay. Matthew 24 and, tw and 45. Who then is a faithful and wise servant whom the Lord hath made ruler over his household to give them meat in due season? Blessed is that servant whom his Lord, when he cometh, shall find him doing. Shall find him doing, man. <clears throat> but he gonna come back and find a whole bunch of idle niggas. Yep. My old ass idle niggas. Saying idle words. Yep. You know? You're not doing what the scripture said, man. That's why we got to keep getting on y'all, man. We got to we got to fight against that shit. Right, brother. So if we if we if we, if we stay quiet, well, we yield, we yielding like we like we were talking about uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. earlier, man. We yielding and, and basically pacifying wickedness. That's right. <laughs> No, man, we're going to come, come against that. We're going to teach Israel to do what the scriptures say. Mm -hmm. Okay? Bring out what you had. This is Isaiah chapter 62, verse 6. Uh -huh. I have set watchmen upon thy walls, O Jerusalem, mm -hmm. which shall never hold their peace uh -huh. day nor night. No, man, you're going to continue to toil and do what you're supposed to be doing. You're doing what the scriptures prescribe. That's what a man of the Lord would do. Right. That's right. right. Especially if he's the only one chosen to bring back the nation. <laughs> <laughs> he will be setting an example. The only <laughs> commanding general. Go ahead. Ye that make mention of the Lord, keep not silence. Keep not silent. But you teaching opposite. Yeah. You, your example is opposite of that. Okay? <laughs> That's not a shepherd. All right. Second Thessalonians 2 and 10. For even when we were with you, this we commanded you, that if any would not work, neither should he eat. If he ain't going to work, neither should he eat. That's right. He's eating a whole lot. Yeah. <laughs> and, and he eating good, man. And a lot of you brothers that's in GMS, you ain't working, but you eat. Right. You know? That's right. And, and, and the most I put the spirit on the elders to start exposing brothers, man. Yep. But it bullshit. It's time to hunker down, man. We got to take this thing seriously. That's right. This is life or death. Why wouldn't you do it as uh, diligently and meticulously as possible? Be nerdy about it. Yep. Yep. Be a geek. All right? Spiritual geek. Don't just let little stuff slide that don't make you feel comfortable. This is life or death. Do it as life or death. Or if you don't want to, get away from me. Right. Go ahead. For we hear that there are some which walk among you disorderly. I mean, it's some that walk among us disorderly. The Most High is going to reveal that. Lord willing, I'm not one of them. So I got to get nerdy about this thing. That's right. Be a scared nerd. Yeah, that's right. Can't do that. I'm telling you. <laughs> it's right here. I'm telling you. It says it right there. <laughs> hey, somebody get uh, somebody get yeah. Sirach 33 and 13 and hold it for me. Yeah. You got to want to do it the right way. Go ahead. Working not at all, but our busybodies. Working not at all, but you're busybody, man. <laughs> Oh. 
Hey, 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 hey. They might be, this might be making some brothers feel uncomfortable. Good. That's right, good. I, I feel attacked. Well, you are being attacked, right? Would you rather?